What's up, everybody? Just here, back with my final NXT reaction. Chelsea Green video package with uh, Robert Stone. She is looking damn good. Zack Ryder, I don't know how you got her, but you're a lucky man. Phantasma. Reaction to Gentleman Jack Gallagher against the NXT debut of Phantasma. Should be damn good. Cruiserweight tournament first round matchup. They call it the interim, interim cruiserweight tournament because whoever wins the title, Jordan Dublin is still going to have his title. Uh, can come back in a couple months, I hope, come back to America and say, I never lost. So it could be cruiserweight champion versus the new cruiserweight champion. Jack Gallagher, I'm pretty surprised they didn't release him. I'm glad they didn't. Here comes Phantasma. The guy's damn good in Mexico. He has four names, but I'm going to just call him Phantasma. I don't know how old he is. They say he has 20 years of wrestling. So he is fourth generation. Phantasma's fourth generation wrestler. His uncle, his cousin, and his father were luchadors. I think he's under 40, I'm going to guess. I don't know. Maybe he's under 35. I don't know when he started wrestling. Probably at 15. Ray Mysterio, I believe, started at like 14 or 15. Not to mention earlier on tonight, Kushida knocked off Tony Nese. Jack Gallagher, I haven't seen him wrestle in months because I stopped watching 205 Alive. Jack Gallagher uh, changed his look. He's in wrestling trunks. There's a giant tattoo on his chest, which looks stupid, but maybe he likes it. I don't know. He must like it. I don't like tattoos. Not a fan of it. Sometimes you can be a little bit too nice, a little bit too gentlemanly, and I like the direction Jack Gallagher is going. There is nothing it's like Gallagher even has Gallagher new tattoos on his arm, on his uh, left arm. Big drop kick by Phantasma. One count. A one count. A very important buyer here this matchup for Group B competitors. We mentioned Tozawa's victory last week. You want to keep pace in this round robin style tournament. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you want to come out with that first win. You want to have momentum on your side. Or rest your backs against the wall. And that pressure just continues to build. Remember, the four competitors in each group will face each other once. And then the superstar with the best record advances to the championship match. Oh, caught. Now, Taylor dumping Phantasma. There's a cover. That was a nice uh, counter. Jack caught him, slammed him down. The matches I did see, uh, Jack Gallagher have on 205 Live were very good, very good matches. 
I mean, you want it. I forget. Jack yeah, got a bad feud with someone. I uh, can't remember. Could have been Brian Kendrick or. No, I am Dar or. Oh, I forget. But he had a feud with someone on 205 Live. They had a couple of matches, like Street Fight Zones, Bard. It was damn good. Jack Gallagher is no joke. He is fucking good. Big kick. I mean, Fantasma jumped on the apron with a kick. Flip. Jack over the top. Backwards. Had his arms and like a crucifix. Fantasma gone for a dive. There's a rolling somersault over the top. Side cross body. Who will score a victory in this Cruiserweight Championship Tournament? Good action so far. I like what I see from uh, Phantasma and Jack Gallagher. I'll be back. Jack Gallagher, Phantasma's back. First round of the NXT Cruiserweight Championship Tournament. It's Wednesday night, wrestling night. That means it's uh, live NXT reactions from me because I watch NXT live and first. I like AEW, I enjoy AEW, but I enjoy NXT more. I always watch uh, AEW later. And it's recording during NXT. Jack has the wrist lock, arm lock, and then I'll let release it. Phantasma was in AAA. The guy was in Lucha Underground. He was even in Impact Wrestling for a little bit. Now he's in NXT. He's tall, awesome. Man. Phantasma is pretty big. I thought he'd be shorter. I like uh, Phantasma's gear, his pants. Pretty cool. His trunk is a uh, trunk. His tights, whatever you call wrestling pants. Trunks, tights, not trunks, but. Big kick. Gallagher falls to the floor. Phantasma's going for a dive. Hell of a dive. Head first into Gallagher. Flying, flying missile at the head of Gallagher. I wish uh, fans were here and to cheer for Phantasma's NXT debut. I'll tell you the truth, there's not going to be wrestling fans allowed back in arenas or in the PC, they're not going to be allowed back, I don't think, until 2021. Nice roll up, Phantasma, the nice roll up into a package and Jack's legs hooked, Jack kicked out. Jack almost pulled the mask off. Kick out by Phantasma. Big headbutt. 
by Jack Culver. Come on, Fantasma, you can't lose this. It's your debut. Can't lose this. Jack is getting frustrated. You can tell. Can't put away Phantasma. Missed in the corner. Laying on his feet. Phantasma picks him up. Shoulders. It's over. Fantasma wins his NXT debut. He goes on. He advances in the Cruiserweight Tournament. It's kind of big for a Cruiserweight, I think, but so what? Fantasma did not hold back. He went balls to the wall. Really good match. They did the right thing by putting over Fantasma. Tozawa is 1 and 0. Fantasma is 1 and 0. Drake Maverick. 0-1, Tony Nese. Is, um, I forget. Fantasma coming a promo in Spanish. I don't know what he's saying. Wish I did. Good for him that he's talking to his people, to, to all his fans in Mexico. So the main event is Velveteen, Keith Lee against Adam Cole, Roderick Strong. I will not be doing a reaction to that, but I will enjoy it. Hope you enjoy my three, three NXT reactions tonight. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye for now.